finally, a two for the price of one exclusive to end tonight's programme with a pair of the biggest stars of British stage and screen acting. The occasion is a new play in London, but now, but visiting Cardiff in May, about the legendary post-war Labour figure Nye Bevan and the creation of the NHS. Starring Michael Sheen, the production will be live-streamed into cinemas next month under a national theatre scheme championed by none other than Dame Helen Mirren. Every hospital in this country will be nationalised. He was the father of the NHS. Hospitals. Better hospitals. And in Tim Price's epic play Nye, Anirin Bevan appears throughout in his pyjamas on his deathbed. Through flashbacks, we see how a Welsh miner's son with a stammer rose to be one of Britain's most powerful politicians. Well, my mum and dad came to see it last week, yeah. and my dad's in his mid-80s now, and he was a little kid when the NHS came in, and it, it really struck me that there's not really anyone around who was an adult when the NHS mm. came in, and who can remember what it was like before. Michael Sheen stars as the socialist firebrand from Tredegar. You say this play is timely, why do you say that? The NHS has to uh, be reimagined, I suppose, in many ways, the kind of audacity of Bevan's vision. Uh, and the drive and the, and the determination to, um, to bring those, those fundamental beliefs about um, you shouldn't be denied basic health care because of your you know, lack of means. So the vision that grew out of that um, has to be reimagined now um, because you know, the, the NHS is in, is, is in all kinds of difficulties. Nye will be the 100th National Theatre play broadcast live in cinemas across the country since Dame Helen Mirren starred in Fedra in 2009. It's something she says is very important to her. Having spent a lot of my career in the theatre, having seen incredible performances and thinking future generations will never know mm. how brilliant this performance was, it was always very heartbreaking for me. I think it's a great education tool for, for and to, to make theatre a much more accessible, mm. available thing. National Theatre Live has expanded significantly since 2009. Next month, many hundreds of cinemas will broadcast Nye Live, and this time 1,400 NHS workers will be given free tickets. I meet people outside of the stage door, you know, who say I've been working in the NHS for 30 years or, and they're so moved by the production and, and they just want to say, you know, thank you for doing it. But I mean, it's just an opportunity to say thank you to them for their, for their service, you know. So it's very exciting. It's a very exciting thing to be part of the 100th NT Live, but also um, that it's going to be a blue light performance for the NHS workers as well. Every doctor will work for this service. For one night then, access to art, like healthcare, will be free for many. A fitting tribute to one of Wales's most famous sons. Rhys Williams, News at 10.